Um, welcome to the next video. Um, this one is um, loop recording um, using MIDI, this is. Um, now, there's five different um, loop recording options you've got. Um, if you go into the transport panel and go to this section, you'll see mix, overwrite, keep last, stack and stack two. In this video, we're just going to look at mix and overwrite. Okay, so we've got mix selected. Um, I've got a drum loop here and I've always already selected a sound. So what I'm going to do now is play the MIDI um, in mix mode um, along to this. I'll have the click on as well and the pre-count. And in mix mode what happens is when you get to the end and it cycles back it will allow you to play more MIDI over the top of the last MIDI that you recorded. It's great if you're not very proficient on the keyboard and you want to play complex kind of patterns and stuff but you, you, you just can't do that so you can you can use this to do it so if I hit record I'll show you what I mean okay as you can see it's playing what I played Record's still on and it's still going back. It isn't overwriting anything. So now if I play more stuff in, it will play it over the top of this. So that's mix mode. You can do that as many times as you like and um, play it in. Uh, keep playing to your heart's content until you get it perfect. And obviously you can have auto quantize on that will keep it nice and tidy for you. Um, so that's mix mode. Let me just delete that. Now um, I'll show you overwrite mode. Um, you probably guess what it does. Um, I can now play MIDI in. When it gets to here and cycles back, if I continue to play, it will overwrite everything that was there before. Um, basically, this is, um, again, it's great if you're like me and you're no good on the keyboard, and it takes you maybe three or four times to play in a decent rhythm. You can just keep going until you get that perfect um, uh, part, or the, that perfect take, and then um, you can just stop and you'll have the perfect take left. So let's have a look. This time I put auto quantize on just to show you. So again, um, I've got the click and the cycle on and the pre-count, sorry. So now if I hit record, one, two. Now because I'm not playing, Because I'm not playing, that MIDI remains. Now the next time, I'll play and you'll see that MIDI disappear. So as you can see, this one is very good for um, just to keep playing and playing and playing until you get that perfect take. Um, so that's it. That's um, mix and overwrite. The rest will be in the next video. Thanks for watching.